We're here with ODU freshman Caroline Sorbel. Um, Caroline, thanks for joining us. Um, why did you uh, choose Old Dominion? Um, so I chose Old Dominion because we're in Virginia Beach and that's a great location. Uh, definitely for soccer. Uh, the athletics here are fantastic and I'm having such a great time. And of course education. I'm coming to college to be a nurse so that's mainly why I chose Old Dominion. Um, you travel a lot, a lot with your club team. Uh, talk about all your travels with them. Well, I can give you one experience that I definitely remember the most. We went to my best travel that I did for my club team was going to Vegas, and that was so much fun. Like even though it was just for soccer, and I'm not 21, can't gamble and all that stuff, I still had a great time. Um, we always, my club team, we were just the best to travel with, and definitely experiences like Disney and Vegas and Charlotte. Um, were always a lot of fun. What were some of your favorite things to do in Las Vegas? Um, well, since it was our last away tournament this past year, uh, the parents all got us a party bus, like this big party bus, and the, the moms came with the daughters, and they took us around all the old Las Vegas strips, and it was just, there was like concerts going on, and we walked around and danced, and that was just like a lot of fun. You're from Bridgewater, New Jersey. Uh, tell me about where you're from. Well, Bridgewater is not really a small town. Like, we had 750 kids in my graduating class, so I definitely didn't want to go to a small college because I would have felt like it was kind of just like high school. And I thought Old Dominion with, what, we have 35,000 kids. That's, like, that was perfect size. Um, so, well, Bridgewater, we were an athletic school mainly. Our cross team was very good. I feel soccer was good as well. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know, I my 18 years in Bridgewater were some of the best I've ever had well, so far. <laughs> Did you play any other sports in high school besides soccer? Uh, freshman year, I played basketball, which was a lot of fun, but I definitely chose soccer because it I just it was my strength over basketball. Like Basketball was fun, but soccer I knew I wanted to be serious with. Do you have a sport that you like to watch other than soccer? Basketball. College basketball, it's, it's always exciting for me to watch. Um, do you have a favorite athlete or someone you look up to? Uh, so yeah, Tyler Hansborough from uh, UNC basketball. He when he played in college, he's all I he was all I watched, and I just idolized his like work effort, and he was just a he was just a great athlete. <laughs> now we know uh, you work a lot with women's soccer. That keeps you busy. But what do you like to do in your free time? Any hobbies? Well, it does keep me pretty busy. Um, if not, I'm meeting new people since you know, I'm new to the Old Dominion atmosphere. Basically, me and the other freshmen have just been going around meeting everybody, and that's been occupying my time so far. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of things in the Norfolk, Virginia Beach area. Have you been able to, I know there's the zoo and the aquarium. Have you been able to do anything like that? Well, team bonding, we did go to the zoo, which was really cool. It was a really hot day, though. <laughs> um, I definitely want to go to the beach. I have not had the opportunity to go there yet, but... I sat outside of Whitehurst on the dock, which was pretty nice. <laughs> now, you talked about your major is nursing. Um, why did you choose uh, nursing? Um, I feel like I'm good with people, and I'm interested in medicine, and when I combined the two, I came up with nursing. <laughs> is there anything specific you want to get into with nursing, or haven't really thought about it that far? Um, I haven't really thought about it too much. I definitely want to work in a hospital setting, because I for some reason find them very interesting. So somewhere along those lines. Why uh, number 12? I've had number 12 since I can remember and it was actually not available when I when they gave us the numbers to choose from for Old Dominion until like a week later she emailed uh, Stacy emailed us and said number 12 just became available first person emailed back gets the number and I was like oh my god I got it respond quickly so I got it and I was so relieved that the legacy would carry on. <laughs> You're three games into your freshman season. Uh, you're playing a big part on the defensive back line. Uh, what's that been like for you? Um, spectacular. There's really no other way to describe it. I, I'm so glad that I'm getting the opportunity to play, and it's definitely a different experience from high school. You know, college girls are much more aggressive and fast and all this stuff, but I really think that I'm coming into my role as a right back where I'm playing right now, and. I couldn't ask for anything better. It's been good. Uh, college and high school are different in, on many different levels, but the travel is uh, one thing that's very different. Mm -hmm. uh, you, it's last week went to Hartford and flew. 
Uh, what's that been like compared to high school? Well, since classes are starting now, it's definitely gonna be a juggling act. Um, we are traveling this weekend for Radford, and I'm gonna miss class. But you know, I you gotta just notify your teachers and all that. But the travel, the bus isn't bad. I sleep through the whole ride. <laughs> the plane's not that bad. I'm good with flying, um, and you know, the whole team gets along. So the whole rooming situation, not it's not an issue so far. <laughs> What's your favorite food? What do you like to eat? Okay, well, my mom would want me to say that I really like her French onion soup. <laughs> she makes it from scratch, and it's delicious. <laughs> so I would say that. <laughs> Where do you, uh, what's your favorite restaurant? Uh, well, every Friday when I was in Bridgewater, we would go to this place called Alfonso's, and it's just the family Italian restaurant. We knew all the waiters and the managers and the bartenders and everybody, and it was always oh, just like a great time, Friday nights.